Hi all, welcome to my challenge Java Soul. Today we will see um, how to implement LRE case. Before we start this video, if you are new on my channel, please subscribe my channel. I have already created multiple programming interpretations video. We will provide the link in the description. You can go and watch from there. So as per the de definition of LRE case, it's a type of data structure used to store fixed number of items in memory where the least recently accessed item is removed when the case reaches its maximum size. So the purpose of LRU case is to improve the performance by storing frequently accessed data in memory. Okay, let's implement uh, LRU case now. So I have already created one class main case. Okay, we will we need to create a one more class LRU case. We'll write the logic there. LRU case. Okay, and I'm um, just making um, it as a generic okay and the type k will be a key and b will be a value for this so whenever we will create an object of lru case we need to pass here on the type okay in our case k will be an integer so key will be an integer value will be as in a string okay let's take two variable what will be a private and final first one will be a capacity second variable will be in a map of type k as a key and p as a value We are getting an error because we need to initialize these variables. Let's create a um, constructor and there we will, will there we will initialize these variable. Okay, I'm taking parameterized constructor. Capacity and will initialize. Sorry, we'll assign this value to capacity. I mean this parameter value. This dot case and will create an object of link as map. Okay. Now you can see error is gone. Okay. So we need to create two um, methods get input as earlier I told. So let's create first get method public which will returns basically um, B okay get and the parameter will be a K basically it's a key this dot case dot get or default okay if the key is exists in the map then it will returns the value otherwise it will return a null public void put method and in parameter will use key and value so we need to check this key is already exist or not in the map this dot case dot contains key okay then we'll check the size of this map is greater than equal specified capacity okay so I'm adding here negation if key does not exist in the map then only we will check okay the size if all condition will true then the control will come inside okay what we are doing what what we are actually trying to do we are checking first key should not be exist in the case 
then we are checking the size of map is greater than or equal to capacity means in case a case means map we cannot add any more value okay if the map size is uh, full sorry map is full so we need to remove least recently used um, data this dot case we'll call key set function then we'll call iterator and then we'll call next okay it will returns the least used okay value least recently used value okay recently used key we will call a remove function okay and we'll pass this variable okay it will remove this key from the map here we will call a put function and we'll add key and value okay that's it now uh, to print what exactly is there in the map I'm creating one more method print uh, here we will see out Mm hmm sorry Cassie. okay now let's create an object of LRU cache as I told we need to pass here type integer cache new LRU cache and then we need to pass the capacity of uh, we need to pass here capacity yeah so I'm passing three the size of the map will be only three means only we can add three records in the map let's call a put method and pass one as a key one as a value also Two as a key, two as a value, three as a key, and three as a value. Okay, let's print this first. Hey, what happened? Nothing getting printed. Oh, shit. So we need to call a print function. okay now here you can see map having a key 1 2 and 3 okay value also 1 2 and 3 okay now let's try to update the value for the key 2 bit 4 okay case a dot put key will be uh, 2 and value i'm updating with 4 okay let's run it so now you can see the value is being updated from 2 to 4 okay let's remove this again um, run this program and now you can see the value is updated now okay with 2 to now what I'm trying to do I'm adding one more record with key 4 and value also okay so okay let me execute this and then we'll explain you now you can see the record with key one is removed from map okay so now now let's understand with um, you know um, some diagram how it's work 
as you can see in this diagram okay we do have a one map as uh, this arrow point to the least recently used key in the case after given operation okay now as um, can see here um, I'm calling the put method and passing a key as a one value as a one okay this record is now um, added to the map okay now we are I'm trying to add um, the two uh, as a key and two as a value okay and here it also added and three also added okay because this record <coughs> was least recently used okay so the arrow is with one okay so whenever I will try to okay add any value okay uh, I mean uh, add any record then the record the key will get removed okay because this record was added in starting okay so means this least recently used okay now as you can see here one is removed now this uh, arrow is pointing to the record with key 2 okay whenever I will um, do some operations like I'm calling the get get 3 okay that means uh, it's not a least recently okay this record will be uh, most recently okay okay if I'm trying to um, add any new record then the record with key 3 will not be removed okay because as per this um, uh, LRU case it will remove only least recently used key so till now 2 is least recently used okay so I'm trying to call um, record with key 1 but there is no record with key 1 now I'm trying to call the record I'm trying to get the record with key 2 okay now this array is moved from the record with key 2 to the record with key 4 okay because we we just turn some operations okay with key 2 okay so this record with the key 4 is become a least recently used key okay now I'm trying to put basically trying to add one more record because the array here you can see is with record um, with key 4 so it will remove this record okay this 4 now as you can see here the operation which I did like I, I try to get other record with the key 2 okay just before add 5 and before calling this cat method with key 2 I called a get method with key 3 okay that means most recently um, basically um, most recent will be a 5 okay and before this we did some operations on a 2 and before 2 we did with 3 so 3 will be a least recently used key okay now if here what I'm doing I'm trying to get again the 4 with key 4 but there is no record with key 4 okay here also I'm trying to get the record with key 3 okay now you can see here this arrow arrow sorry arrow is moved to the key 2 so 2 is become the become the least recently used key if I'll try to add any um, other records then this record will get removed from the map that's what it is okay so I have done with this video um, if you like this video please subscribe my channel okay and provide some comments thanks thanks for watching